for this, who would have thought? Springtime. And I've just become the mayor of the Byron Bevan. I've got a couple of episodes of the Charlie version too. And on um, this computer map shop, around here, Mr. Patel's my company size. Good times, just like old times. Well, sometimes it's difficult to do a peer review when you've only got two hands. Burton Bridge Brewery Sovereign Gold, 4% alcohol by volume, and the coffee machine is warming up. So that's why there's no, see there, no large cappuccino yet. So, live. Ooh. That's all in the aftertaste, a sort of bitter, slight citrusy taste. Anything more than that, I can't come up with a term for, but that'll do for me. Very pleasant. A good start to the day. And the second beer of the day, well, this one from the Daily Source Code, is Welsh. Put it down. Um, from the Vale of Glamorgan Brewery, and this is light headed, 4% alcohol by volume, and a picture of Nash Point Lighthouse. Hmm. Very Moorish, gentle taste, slightly bitter. I think that'll be plus plus for the drinkability. I'm feeling a full English coming on, I gotta be honest. And beer number three, and notice the vinegar, so there's a large breakfast on the way. This is Romney Export from the Romney Brewery, which isn't in Romney, it's in Carland, Dowlas. <coughs> 5% alcohol by volume. It's robust Valley Zale. Sounds like I know what I'm talking about, but I haven't a clue actually, so here we go. That's a solid brew. I like that. That's the sort of thing that will make me rather tipsy. I'll give that an A minus. And the breakfast has arrived with lots of toast and. Um, Better, and I'm listening to the lascivious biddies. Biddy cast. <laughs>